<laughs> Look, babe. It's the nerd mobile. <laughs> Ghostbusters call us. And that's actually badass. I'm like, I, it, it's the Ecto-5, if you've noticed. Not Ecto-1. Oh my gosh. But at, at least it's done up. What's up, everybody? It's Grim. I'm here with Tina. And we are at RetroCon in the Greater Philadelphia Expo Center. It's, gonna it's so much fun. primarily a toy show. But guess who else is going to be here, I think. I, hopefully we didn't miss him. Who? Zack Ryder, a.k.a. Matt Cardona is his real name. He lost the internet championship last night to some dude named Effie. And now I got to go laugh at him. Because he should have put the title on the line against me. This is weird. They sell cats here, too. Uh, sweetie, is this the show? What the fuck? It's a toy show. Uh, what is this, a cat convention? We walked into a freaking cat show. Babe, pussy galore in there. But I listen, know, I want to go back. There were normally, so cute ones. Normally, I'd be all about the pussy, but I'm here for toys right now. Oh, well, look, there's a new assignee to GTS Wrestling Super Mario. Oh my gosh, he's back. So we must be on the right track. Wait one fucking second here. I was hyped to come in here to see Ecto-1. And this is not Ecto-1. This is like if I ordered Ecto-1 off Wish. This is like the great value Ecto-1. And they're the great value Ghostbusters. All right, I get the cosplay of it all, but I want the real Ecto-1. They got the fucking real Batmobile. Look at how sick. The original Batmobile. Batman. Sit in the Batmobile for a picture. Boo! Boo! I knew as soon as I started reading that, sit in the Batmobile for a picture, I was going to say, no, I'm way too fat for that shit. But, whoa, what is that thing? It's like a Lotus. Oh, yeah, the old 80s Lotuses. I've never actually seen one of these in person. And there he is. Zack Ryder. Babe, we gotta go over and talk to Zack Ryder. I gotta mess with him. Oh my god, yes. I am here with the legend. The legend, Matt Cardona. Zack Ryder, but don't tell anybody. And look what he has. Baby, zoom in, look. The GCW spinner. The greatest thing that's ever happened to GCW is this guy right here. I'm putting you over, Matt. I appreciate that. I, I, you know the deal. I know you used to beef with Kurt Hawkins back in the yes. day. Uh, does he still fear you? I think he does, because I challenged him last week at SWF, yeah. and he's like, oh, I'm with Impact. I can't have a match. Uh, but, dude, you work everywhere, man. You can, you're you doing it. What you're doing right now is inspiring. It really is. Just like Z, true Long Island story 10 years true. ago, which inspired you, Prince you put me over. I, like I will, and I will. You know why? Because I was one of the OG Zack Ryder fans. I've been a fan of this man for 10 plus years, and he makes me proud every time. There's yet to be something you've done that has disappointed me. Well, I'm just gonna, I'm just I, I, I have something right here. This is this is live on YouTube. It's for your vlog. Your yes. vlog. I know Kurt Hawkins might be signed with Impact, but I'm not signed anywhere. So if you want a chance at this or one of my many championships, I can come to your little backyard promotion. If you pad the lope, baby, All right, listen. I'll be there. If I listen, pad the lope, I'll, I mean pay me. He wants a fat envelope, baby. A fat envelope. And, you know, and I'll put a title on the line. One-on-one -on -one Grimber is always ready. I like the sound of that. I didn't even say it. That, I didn't even just, complete the sentence, and I, and I love it. It's, it's money, yeah. and we're going to do this. Rimamania 2022. Yeah. Yeah. It has to happen. Talk to my agent. And it would be for the internet championship, but somebody lost it to Effie. All right. Get this fucking guy out of here, man. Get him out of here. You lost to Effie, though. Get out of like here. Like, Effie. I, I was proud of you up until that moment. I got really excited from across the room. I thought you were the Sarge. And I was like, I'm a maggot. But then he's not the Sarge, but you look like the Sarge. That's an epic cosplay. Is it cool if you're in my vlog? Oh, yeah. All right, then you're in my vlog. There he is. Call me a maggot or something. You are a maggot. I am a maggot. And I'm a maggot that's going to fight Matt Cardona at Grimmamania 2022. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I'm a grim maggot. Okay. Great to meet you, Sarge. Great to meet you. Yo, Good Joe. Job. Knowing's yeah. half the battle and all that other stuff. Holy shit. Look at this fucking guy. The show is wild. Whoa, baby, it's behind you. That's the newest character on GTS Wrestling. Besides, you know, what's his name over there? Mother of God, it's Snake Eyes. Oh my god, it's all the Joes. All the Joes are here. Ah! <laughs> the Cobra Commander and shit. Now, now this is a convention. That is friggin' awesome. You got the Dreadnoughts, Beachhead. 
Oh my god, look at the dreadnoughts. This is fucking hilarious. This is, oh wait, and then they got like a blue Boba Fett over there. The Mandalorian. Dude, if there's a kid dressed up like a good baby Yoda, I'm gonna lose my shit. I will freak the fuck out. Just guarding shit, making sure everything's okay. I'm a little freaked out, not gonna lie. That was, that was awkward. That was awkward with the weird Boba Fett guy. Yeah. Right? I'm like, not sure what he was trying. Is it Blueberry? Is blueberry Boba? I think it's Blueberry Boba. It's Blueberry. There she is, the queen. Nice to see you. Babe, there are so many freaking toys here. I'm, I might go ham. I might go wild. One like equals one prayer. I don't know what the hell I'm going to do. I need one of everything, Tina. Is, Wait, do they have right. a shopping cart up here? They, they should. I need the moray. I need that four pack over there of the Transformers that's marked up double the freaking price from Target. Oh my, there's just so much everything. There's another Moray eel. Oh my God, oh my God, Crash Dummies. I love those. I watched the show as a kid. I didn't even know they had for Pirates of Dark Order. What the hell? And bro, there's so much cosplay here too, it's so cool. I love the cosplay. This is incredible, the space balls here. I'm surrounded by assholes. <laughs> Thank you guys. That Spaceballs the flamethrower, babe. The Spaceballs movie. This is incredible. This is so much fun. That's the coolest cosplay I've ever seen in the history of the world. I have to show you guys my earrings. Oh yeah, we just got Beavis and Butthead earrings. It's amazing. Beavis and Butthead earrings. Those are amazing. I'm so excited for those. I can't wait to wear them. I'm afraid to wear them because if I keep pulling my mask off, they're going to fly off. Yeah, yeah, don't do it now. Oh my god, it's a bin of butt figures. Look at it, they got Jerry Lawler. Al Snow. This is the guy that always wants head. <laughs> Just like me. And then we got, this guy was the pig farmer. Just like me. Oh my god, look. I think somebody painted this one. See, that's the thing about loose figures. You never know where they've been. Oh my I'm God. horrified. Wait, I'm very confused. Look at what they look at it. This it, it's all like melted and discolored and disfigured. Oh dear. What they like baked in the sun. Look at this thing. This was the worst. These were the worst. We got three dollars each. What a deal. All right, listen. We have to cut the camera because I don't want to be embarrassed all over the internet about how many of these butt figures I'm about to buy. So I have a dilemma, and the dilemma is there's this toy over there from a series called Mask baby and this it's the one toy of the entire collection I don't have and it is ridiculously overpriced but but fairly priced because you can't find them anywhere and it's the only one I don't have and I don't know what I'm gonna do so what I'm gonna do is breathe yeah, we have to sell we're, more gonna, stuff on eBay. we're gonna walk around <sighs> listen <laughs> I'm, I'd be putting this on a credit card I don't have the money to actually get it we're gonna make, but, have to make more contact in other places then boy, 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 boy. I don't know, we're gonna see, am I gonna get it or not? <sighs> Breathe. Oh, what the hell just happened? We just walked into the Star Wars zone. Oh my, oh my God, there's little Jawas. This is almost like we're at Disney World. Yeah. This is what it's like at Disney World now. Yeah, that they do? Yeah, they're just, they're, they walk all over the place and this, patrol things. It's the 501st Legion. They're right there, look. That's wow. why. This is like the super cosplay people and they're selling all this cool Star Wars stuff. But I'm still contemplating the super rare mask vehicle, babe. Yeah. I don't know. This this is so exciting. I just want to make sure I'm not going to come across anything else. And plus, I I, I what? Well. Watch out! I think he's challenging you. Be careful. He's gonna sword. Well, listen. If I pulled my sword out, they would arrest me. <laughs> I think somebody's provoking the obese. Listen, uh, you face mask wearing, sword saber having. You just made the menu. Babe, he doesn't seem to care that he made the menu. I don't know what to do. We have a lightsaber. Why didn't we bring it? Yeah. We we'll have the Yoda saber. saber. You know what happens to lightsaber guys who come after me? You just made the menu. Yeah, that's and, and you make, you're going to eat my feet. You're going to eat it, yeah. He, he, why is he not scared? Because he's got a sword? Yeah. All right, gonna hold this. I'm just going to RKO him out of nowhere. It's our only chance. Okay, I want to know where. I win. Ding, ding, ding. <laughs> he 
doesn't find me amusing. You're like half the comment section. <laughs> Brother. <laughs> Let me tell you something, Kylo Ren. What you gonna do when the biggest arms on YouTube come for you, dude? When we step inside the Sky Dome, one-on-one -on -one for the championship, brother. <laughs> you don't want the smoke, babe. These hats might have. Yes, I got the Maleficent one. I just, I like to stand out. This would make me definitely stand out. Do you even know what anime that's from? Yeah, of course I do. It's um, this one. That one that I watch all the time. It's my, right here, My Hero Academia. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what it's from. Well, listen, I'm getting it anyway. Make fun of me. I'll start watching the show right now. <laughs> See, it's good, she said. That rider is a bumble lion. That was a wuzzle. Bumble lion. And I'll tell you about that bumble lion because I'm about to ruin my brother's life. <laughs> because when Duop was little, he had that thing, mm -hmm. and it was like his teddy bear. He wouldn't go to sleep without it, and he'd cuddle it in. <laughs> and like, God forbid you couldn't find his bumble lion. He would stomp around the house crying, Where's my bumble lion? Where's my bumble lion? <laughs> so I want you to all go to Doohop's channel, go in his comment section, and say, Grim exposed you about bumble lion. <laughs> Babe, they came for me, they found me. You gotta get me out of here. Who told you you me? <laughs> <laughs> I'm going under the table. That's right. You don't want this smoke. See, he don't want to mess with me. We should have dressed you up for a proper cosplay today. He was he was scared, Mandalorian. He came at me and he was about to attack and then he saw my skills and was like, oh, I don't want none of this. And he took off running the other way. No, 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 not the Teddy Rex thing. What? No, no, no. It's, what, it's, this? It's just as bad as Furby if maybe we're... Are you afraid of me, no, Tina? I like him. I Are you afraid of me, no, Tina? No, no, no. <laughs> well, you, you'd think it was like the Mandalorian or something. It's not that scary. I don't know what the fuck they're when they're creepy. Like, their eyes go crazy and they talk when there's no batteries in them and stuff like that. <laughs> it's just as bad as Furby. I don't know what kind of demons are in those things. Right, I'm so not should sure. I book the match one-on-one? -on -one? <laughs> Tina versus Teddy. <laughs> This is something you don't see every day. Holy shit. Happy Meal boxes from McDonald's. This is what our fucking hamburgers used to come in. The Happy Meal boxes. Burger King, oh my God, babe, look, the 80s Burger King. Oh my King. gosh. Oh, Burger King cup holder. Oh my God, holder. look at those bags and little play mask. <gasps> this child. is freaking amazing. I love these boxes. I used to play with them with my toys, too. Yeah. I used to pick my toys in them. That is so cool. Oh, look, and this little asshole rides around. <laughs> oh, wait a minute, look at Toka. Idol. Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice, Beetlejuice. Yes, say his name three times. Hey, watch it with the B word. <laughs> <laughs> that was cool. You got yes. to meet your idol. Yes. There he is, the B. I can't Beetle wait to juice. see you on Broadway again. Next <laughs> trick. Yes. What did you have? It's blue. Oh, my God, look it's at that. It's blue. I want the blue. I didn't even know they made that. That is really cool. That is a Toys R Us exclusive. $450. Oh my god. At the time it was $450? Yes. I mean, it's $100. It's $100 now? It's pretty heavy. Wow. Pick it up. It's got weight to it. Can I check it? Yeah. It's literally dinosaur sized. Wow. It's a baby blue. Wow. It's so cute. I actually got a hundred quarter on it, but $100. I want to. <laughs> He's probably tired of carrying it around. Oh my gosh. They're the oh, ugliest. Those are so weird looking. It's ugly ass Steve Austin with his big gargantuan dirty ass arms. What? I said I'm deformed. What? <laughs> oh my gosh. When did these come out? <laughs> these were like from the 90s. Wow. They got a Undertaker that skin tone don't match his face, don't match his body. What? <laughs> uh, no. Gross. That's a fail and a half. Dun, 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 dun. Play the music. Dun, 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 funny if he knew who you were. That's actually a famous YouTuber who's sitting back. This is the convention, and there is an actual person in that Pikachu costume. You can see the leg. They just completely gave up on life. 
And it's just chilling in the corner. Holy... What? Oh, wow. <laughs> and then hold this. Yes. Can they see you? <laughs> Flexing that I'm a Decepticon. Yes. I want to see if they want to make the menu. Can they even see? So I didn't do it, and I'm proud of myself because, I mean, all right, first of all, I would have completed the mask collection, but then when the collection's over, then what do you do? You sell it, right? <laughs> I don't know. I, I, I didn't want to finish the collection off, and I didn't want to spend all that money, money I don't have, on a credit card. Instead, I bought myself this $20 transformer. I'm going to pull him out of there. I bought this for 20 bucks, and I'm very satisfied because it's cool, and I'm excited about it. And it was twenty dollars, and I didn't feel like you know I overspent on something that, you know, at least if I did buy that thing, I could always sell it. Yeah. But I have so much, I gotta sell it. I don't even have a house. I don't have anywhere to display. You're gonna it. have to have Grimm's toy store for a little bit. Yeah. That could be fun. I think so. <laughs> Guys, thanks for watching the vlog. We had a fun time, and if you're not down with that, we got three words for you: eat it. Yeah.